Oh yeah, you struck a nerve. You did that on purpose, you weatch. What's up, everybody? My name is Lei Hua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on Twitch.tv slash Lei Hua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to the Genius Princess Guide. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, so you'll be notified on the next upload. And if you like to support the channel, we got Patreon, channel membership, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to Genius Princess Guide episode 6. Festival of the Spirit? Yeah, shocked by what? His sister! No, not his sister. That's black hair? She looks devilish. <laughs> Always be decisive. I like how coy she's being. <laughs> In other words, underwear color. Strike a bargain. Stroke her hair. Noogie. <laughs> Man, what is with the flams? Jeez. I feel like it's sort of like Attack on Titan where they were powerful and people feared them. And then when they became inferior, there was discrimination afterwards. Festival of the Spirit. Ooh, we're gonna learn about it. Ooh, we're talking about religion. Is that creepy nun looking lady gonna be in this episode? Aww, she knows he's gonna get upset if anyone talks about her. Or her race, to be specific. Root for him. Ooh. Every orifice in his body. Oh, the gold mine. Oh, you're seeking out new veins? That means more money. 
<laughs> your face. Control your facial muscles. Mmm. Yeah, you don't want to attract unwanted attention. Yeah, what's he doing now? Ooh, so he was like a wall. Intimidating wall. Keeping the nobles in check. Why are they looking like a cult? So in the opening, this chick was connected to the lady that looks like a nun, right? What was with that lady? That lady, his mom? Stepmom? And now they're being attacked. Roll of the dice. <gasps> Were you banking on that? Oh, snap. Who that? Who that? Ah, GTY. <laughs> Oh, there's a prince? Like, another prince? This also looks ominous. What the heck? What's with these, like, dark scenes? Oh! Is everyone showing up for no new opening? <gasps> Put a torch to his face? Oh, oh. Wait, 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 why is that bad? So much hostility! What the heck? Wait, what happened? Like, <laughs> why you skip? Why is there a gap? Ah, here we go. Oh. 
Oh, that's why, because they're at odds with Kavarin, and they're going to the Festival of Spring that is associated with Kavarin. Okay, I get it. Ooh, they're low on men and resources. Uh-huh. Huh. So how did he recognize that those who attacked him were caught in? Aha! Holy elites! Mmm! Mmm! Those silhouettes looked familiar! Yeah, you don't know if you can trust him. Hmm. Touches another's heart. He's very good at getting rid of any uneasiness because he speaks so confidently. It's like, I can't help but believe what you're saying. <laughs> Tristoria? Something about a name with Storia in it makes me think of like other stuff. <laughs> Well, it is Zeno. I'm wondering if she's the real prince. Or maybe she's the princess. He seems like a butthead. Look at that. Loyal man was about to defend his master's honor. Hmm? 
He's so friendly. How come? He seems a bit pushy. Who is that skulking about? Mmm, -hmm, girl, do not ruin this operation because of your vengeance. Talk some sense into her. Oh! Father? Ooh, 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 ooh. Was our suspicion right? I kind of forgot about that skeevy guy during that whole conference, during the battle. What is this? What are they? Pillars of the Levitian. Oh! The holy elite! It's the creepy nun looking lady. This king is pushy. What? Nominate. Why? <laughs> He's like so upset. <laughs> He's like more work for me. Are you part of the bloodline? Oh, you can. Big wigs from the Western lands. I feel like there's enemies everywhere. Everywhere he turns, enemy, enemy. Male chauvinism in is stri is rife. <laughs> what? She looks like she's sweet, but then she has a sadistic side. I mean, look at that side boob!
I wonder if she was the one who was pushing for it, for his nomination. What does complete their salvation mean? There's a shadow on the face! Yo, they got like evil music with her. Yo. She just said to publicly show that the Martins were dominated. Oh yeah, you struck a nerve. You did that on purpose, you weatch. Who are you? You're like in everybody's business. That face. <laughs> Evil smile with a sweet face. Oh, you're reading their lips? Oh, cool. Your traitor will be? What? Ah! <gasps> Wait, what? Ooh, Wayne predicted this. What the heck, man? Interesting. He shall surely be your bane. Yo, this episode didn't have a lot of action, but so much happened. We got introductions of characters. Zeno, that lady. What was her name again? It was like Cardamalia, something like that. Mm -hmm. Is that a flower? Well, oh, she was so... Creepy, oh, like she had a whole sadistic thing going on. Like, I bet she likes to see people tortured and whatnot. She has like a dark past. Someone hurt her really bad. But besides that, Zena totally seems like she is like some royal lineage from Martin. Something happened. I don't know what happened. Like, her brother, her dad, something. Like, they said her brother got burnt to the face. Her dad died. Well, they're implying the dad died. And so on and so forth. And then we got royals within Wayne's kingdom trying to rebel. And then someone in that rebellion, this lady with, like, Maroon, purplish red hair. She seems like she's connected to the lady from the Holy Elites. And then we got the Holy Elites. <laughs> Jeez Elise! And we got that dude, like kind of like the page haircut, like with a little ponytail that Wayne hurt his arm. We got him! It's like, well, geez Louise, man! <laughs> I'm really excited for the next episode. Like, I'm anticipating how things, you know, unfold and how Wayne is going to tackle it. Mm hmm And I'm wondering if, like, the whole Flom thing is going to be brought up again because that lady from the Holy Elites, she seems like she has huge persecution or pers pers uh, discrimination. Uh, towards certain people, places, races. Like, she seems extreme. I'm wondering if she has a thing against Flams. 
I wouldn't doubt it. <laughs> but besides that, what did you guys think about this episode? And what did you guys think about this video? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there is a Discord. The link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash Superfina. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lihua, and this is the Superfina channel reacting to Genius Princess Guide Episode 6. Hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you all in the next one. Later!